before I let y'all go, what is it that you're hoping to get out of this interview? What is it that you're hoping that people come to know, not just about you as individuals, but this lifestyle? Well, the one thing is people always like to judge and people judge what they don't know. So a lot of times we speak and we do these interviews to give them a, you know, a, a little inside of our life to see what it's really about. Mm -hmm. You know, because if, if you're just, if somebody just told you this man got two wives and 28 kids, you're automatically thinking like, like most yeah. people, what the hell? And <laughs> ain't no way possible you can do this. And ain't no way possible you can do that, this, that, this, that. You know, and don't project your insecurities mm -hmm. on everyone else. Right. You know what I mean? Because because evidently we're doing it, we're built for it. Yeah. Everybody's not built for it. You know, I have some people that come to my house and they're not used to, any kind of noise, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? So, so they can't stay too long, you know? Um, <laughs> we not, we not at the top of the list for birthday parties, you know, to be invited, yeah, cause we are you know? <laughs> <laughs> um, and we accept that. So we just want people to accept us for who we are. Mm -hmm. And before you make a judgment call, get some knowledge on it first. Right. You know what I mean? And we also have a campaign that they look in my bio on um, Instagram, the real Mikel, um, for equality. We, we want equality. Um, so we have a petition to make it legal. You know, because people, the government shouldn't have control over how many people you marry or who you marry or whatever. So just like, you know, gays and lesbians can get married if they want to, we want to be able to get married. Why can't she, you know, right. why, why does she have to go to the courts and change her last name when she got a marriage certificate and changed hers? Why can't she have it too? They right. say you know, our belief in two shall become one. Mm -hmm. So me and her was one when we brought this two in. Mm -hmm. And now we're all one, mm -hmm. you know? So if we can make that decision, you know, then the government shouldn't have a say in it. She awesome. should be afforded the same rights. Mm -hmm. Not not to just, just that. And, and I've proven, like, for instance, with medical. Mm -hmm. You know, when I, when I get the family plan, me and her cover and all my kids are covered. Right. Don't matter how many kids I had. Mm -hmm. The plan covers all of them. Mm -hmm. right. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So what's one more? Right. What's one more? So she should be able to have health insurance through me as well. Um, she should be able to change her last name. She should be afforded all the benefits of a wife, mm -hmm. you know, because we're not playing house, mm -hmm. you know? Nope, it's serious. Mm -hmm. Also, also, we trying to shut down all the stereotypes that are out there about a dynamic like this. You know about the black women feuding constantly. You know, yeah, there's nothing but drama. Giving it a negative problem. Yeah, you know, it's not. It's not that. Yeah. It's 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 takes a lot. It mm -hmm. takes a village anyway when it comes to raising kids. So why mm -hmm. is this not accepted as somewhat of a village mm -hmm. when it comes to the kids? And a lot of people think that yeah, this is just a sexual thing. Nope. No, it's not. It's more to it than that. Um, does sex play a part in it? Yeah, of course. The going to kids. I mean, yeah, that does. But you know, it's not forced. Um, I'm not brainwashed because you know, me being the younger of the crew, I for years I've heard, oh, she's brainwashed, or you know, they somehow like took advantage of her and then no, I'm hear it all on the internet. One person was like, That nigga ugly. Why y'all yeah, right. that? I mean, and I and I had to type back, I don't usually answer them, but I had to type back. I said, Did you ever think that maybe I treat them good? Maybe what? Maybe I treat them good. <laughs> you know, everybody has their own preference of likes, looks, and whatever. Like, you know, it's not always the physical aspect that attracts you to someone. You know, it could be other things. Like, physical play a part in it because you yeah. got to be attracted well, to somebody. Yeah, somehow, of course. Right. You know, but a relationship is not going to sustain on that alone. Right. You know what I mean? Jasmine, yeah, I, how much younger, Jasmine, how much younger are you than them? Well, him and I are 14 years apart, and I think her and I are eight or nine years apart. So, yeah. <laughs> Got you. I should have asked you this earlier. How many bathrooms in that house? Four. Yeah. yeah it's four. I mean, four. It's four bathrooms? Mm -hmm. Okay. Because if this were, if y'all would have said <laughs> one or two bathrooms, I'm like, how did 22 people share? <laughs> Lisa, <laughs> even, even, even with now. that many, I get a knock on my door like, can we use y'all bathrooms? Yes. <laughs> they they still use, yeah, they like ours. <laughs> more, so. 
All right. You know, I want to thank you guys for for being so candid and so open. This is obviously uh, a subject matter that most people, we look from the outside through the glass and, and we choose to come to our own decisions without ever asking the parties direct. And, 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 and I'm so grateful that y'all took the time and you, you were very open and honest and, and, and this is your life. It, it's clear. Um, I love Mike, the, 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 the way you were just breaking it down. We're not playing the house. It, this is, we have a real thing going on here because it's easy to assume that this is strictly, you know, any man in particular would look and be like, my God, two wives, it, it, you got the best of all worlds. But anybody with one wife understand, one wife is a lot of work. So it, it ain't like I look at you and, and by any stretch of imagination, it's like this man's life is, is all rose petals and, and rainbows. Dealing with two women is a lot. Dealing with one woman is a lot. But I, I, I really do thank y'all for shedding light on a on a on a lifestyle that that most of us don't really have insight to. So so I'd say continue blessings and and keep it up. You know, I I I, I think that that what y'all are doing, many people might not understand. But here, here's the deal. You you got people in in single. Relationship that, that are not happy. Uh, and and y'all actually seem like y'all got to figure it figured out and y'all are happy. So so congratulations to y'all. Thank, 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 Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Um, with that being said, I'll <laughs> let y'all get back to, you know, when I was coming up, it was a show eight is enough. I'm gonna let y'all get back to 28 is enough. <laughs> <laughs> and do your thing. But thank you so much for dropping in. I appreciate y'all and, and, and continued love, blessings, and all that you do. Thank you. Thank you. You have a blessed day. You as well. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.